wants its users to get more politically active, and it's giving them a new tool to do it. It's created a service called Town Hall. Matt King explains how it could give you direct access to decision makers at all levels of government. Who my congressmen are, not all of them I don't. Well, I'm from Virginia. King Jeffries, I believe. Amid all the hustling and bustling necessary to complete our daily quest for survival, most of us find little time to track the comings and goings and voting records and re-election campaigns, and in some cases, even the names and parties of our elected leaders. I'm still becoming politically active. Uh, I haven't paid enough attention to local elections. I need to be more informed than what I am. <laughs> There's a very low awareness uh, among most Americans for who governs them. And so, political analyst Chris Hahn welcomed Monday the introduction of Facebook Town Hall, a new feature on the social network allowing users to enter their address and see a list of all their elected leaders with options to follow those officials, call them, message them, visit their pages, and receive voting reminders to keep them in or remove them from office. This can only be good. It can only lead to more access to elected officials, more activism among the people, and actually a more responsive elected class, which is great for America. Pew estimates 80% of Americans own a Facebook account, giving its town hall feature a gigantic built-in body of potential users unlikely to abandon the network as they might some politics only activism act. You see what happened in these town halls. A series of raucous town halls held across the country in the weeks leading up to the vote for an Obamacare replacement perhaps played a role in that new bill's failure. Han believes input from constituents can often sway an elected leader's decisions. You know, having worked for many in my career, it absolutely matters. It really does matter. Do you mean like phoning them? It's really about me and the people around me, and which is why we need to speak to our congressmen and get them to do something about things that's going on. In Midtown, I'm Matt King, Fox 5 News. Authorities